Hi, I'm Bonnie Francis, and this is Bonnie Walter. We're back with our seasoned adult show, and Bonnie's come in to tell us what's happening at the senior centers in May. So what are we starting with, Bonnie? Well, May 1st, the beginning of the week. Um, actually, it's Law Day. It's National uh, Law Day throughout the three senior centers. And there's attorneys that will come in and give their time, bunk photo, but you know what I mean, free. <laughs> Can't get the word out. Um, is that actually on the Friday, May 1st? It is actually on May 1st, yes. Okay. And they will do a free information session on different elder care law issues. And then they will do half hour slots for folks to discuss privately with an attorney. Now, is that something they have to call the center ahead of time? They to do get need a to make reservations as far as if they want to, to come to the seminar. No, but to come for um, a session. The to session, yes. And the session, the talk will be around 1 o'clock, and then they said one thirty to 3, they will actually um, speak with folks. Okay. Nothing um, overly involved, but things like um, Medicare, Medicaid issues, Social Security, disability, uh, nursing home and assisted living programs, um, wills, trusts, estates, power of attorney, advanced directives, that kind of thing. Okay. So it's a good opportunity for seniors to get some questions. They're looking to do some of these things that they know they need to take care of. And adult guardianship is another one, uh, that kind of thing. So it's a good chance to get some questions answered. Right. Even if you need to make a private um, an appointment with an attorney, at least you have something to go with to get your information together. So it's a good program. Good, yeah. And again, they're coming to all three centers. Um, on uh, May 4th, uh, Graceville has some nursing students are coming uh, from the AAMC nursing student program and they want, are holding a seminar from 9 to 12. And again, on health issues that concern seniors such as blood pressure, diabetes, and healthy eating. Apparently, the students need to hold a seminar okay. um, for one of their classes. So um, they're very eager, very excited. Uh, so there should be oh, it's a good opportunity. Yes, it's, it's a win-win. It is. It is. It really is. Uh, I think it's an opportunity for them to have interaction with right. the senior population as well. Seniors get some answers. And again, you're getting a new bright mind attacking a problem maybe a little differently, something right. new coming up. So I think it's a great thing. Uh, May 7th, Southersville's traveling to Harrington Casinos. Uh, and you can call the center at 410-438-3159 to reserve a seat. Okay. She's not uh, booked up yet? Not I would have to my, not, okay. not to my knowledge, no. I didn't get a chance to check her before I came, but there were still a couple seats available, so okay. you can check with her. And May 8th, um, Mother's Day tea is happening both at Ken Island and Sellersville actually is doing a Mother's Day luncheon, and the mothers eat free. Wow. Up at Sellersville. And I'm assuming that Shelly's cooking, and she's a good cook, so it'll be a nice luncheon. And again, Betty's doing a tea. So you can call either one of those centers to make reservations as soon as possible. And that's something you have to make sure that you call. Yes, You know, always. you don't want to just show up at the center and no, not think for that they're going to have something right. for you. Right. Yeah. No, those things you really do need to call ahead and be sure that they have your name down. And, right. And they, again, you know, it's like anything else when you're having company. You need to know how many people are coming so you know what to prepare for. Same thing in the senior center. Right. Idea. So that kind of takes care of that first week of May because we're really revving up for the senior summit coming right. up the following week. All righty. Well, thanks for the info. No problem. Good seeing you again. Uh, let me just mention, I almost forgot. Um, for any of you folks, uh, they're in the libraries, they're in the doctor's office, they're everywhere, the Women's Journal. Right. Um, this is the first time the three senior centers went together and a cooperative um, effort effort yep and this takes care of April May and June what's happening in the centers the different trips that are taken care of from April May and June so if you didn't catch numbers or you're not quite sure what's happening get a hold of a women's journal it's a two-page ad right in there. And, if, and if someone doesn't know what's happening at centers each of them have calendars yes they you know can access them and the classes are in session right now but right. you can get an idea of what the centers offer exactly so it's a good opportunity again and the best part is stop by take a tour right, right. and see firsthand as we always joke about it's not your grandmother's senior center right so right. it's a very active There's, places to be that's correct all right dear we'll move on to the next week okay take care